Ah, <laughs> uh, I was hoping his mustache could block bullets. No. Dude, he has a spy Whoa. watch. Oh, we can see through smoke. Well, James Bond. Are these like MI6 operatives or what? That's why it's called Phantom, because they're spies. Maybe. Yeah, it's definitely, like James Bond. Definitely James uh -huh. Bond. Colin, Colin McKinley is a warden. warden. Defender from the, yeah, Majesty Secret Service. Clutch Royale. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. Phantom Sight. Tomorrow. What's this? Why does it sound like a medical thing? Keep track your pulse. Zombie U2. Zombie is a good game, man. Oh, zombie? Oh, yeah, it's called Zombie now. It's some shit. It's good, dude. It's called Zombie U2? Yeah, it was coming. Yeah. Oh, you mean Zombie U. Okay, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, they made it Zombie now. Yeah. Dude, this one's Switch would be sweet, probably. Yeah? It works so well with uh, the Wii U game, man. Yeah. Yeah. It's just the Don't even the oh. shadow. Boom. Oh. Wait. Have hallucinations? Maybe he's changing. Well, how it works with the switch then? Oh, yeah. There he is. We found him. Take him. I'll cover you. He's going into stasis. Contact. Head to the extraction point. Rainbow Six Quarantine. Oh, it's not oh, those. shit. That's not at all. Free player at oh, oh, Early 2020. <laughs> okay. Hi, I'm Bio Jad, and I'm the lead game designer on the next Rainbow Six game. It's called Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Quarantine. I'm part of a new team in Ubisoft okay. Montreal that set out on an exciting new, new game, mission. Create a radically redesigned co-op experience built on the foundations of one of the best shooters of this generation. What Siege is to the PvP shooter genre, we will be to PvE co-op. Hmm. It might be an actual game of like Quarantine the game modes they have with three players, like they have similar things that they've done for like yeah. events. Yeah. Holding you and your operators on the razor's edge. It pulls you together as a squad, facing off against an unknown and devastating parasite. You will risk everything every time you step into quarantine. Stay tuned and start prepping for your next deployment. I can't wait to show you more and have a great E3. Man, that's it. That's cool, though. Every one, every, this game is always good. Rainbow Six games? Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, but with Rainbow Six, they also showed a little trailer for Rainbow Six Quarantine. Yeah. Um, which is the co-op. Which is, yeah, it, what it reminds me of is Rainbow Six, uh, Rainbow Six has a... Uh, Oh, it, they had like events where it was kind of like these this alien stuff came down and it caused kind of like these were mutation alien monster zombie yeah. things. But it was a outbreak? three. Maybe it was called outbreak. I forget. I can't remember. But it was like but a three-player co-op thing, and you had like 
special zombie kind of guys that were like, you know, tanks and stuff. So it was, you had to work together and fight them and hold off hordes and stuff. But it seems like it might be taking that kind of concept and making a full, full game. game out of it. Yeah. So um, the, the, the events and stuff they had were fun. Like, I enjoyed them. The, the problem I had was we usually had like four or five people wanting to play, and it's only a three player co op. Yeah. So sure. that was the issue we had. So usually we would just play the multiplayer instead of playing the event stuff. Yeah, so I never actually got to play the event stuff. Maybe this time they'll have them play as the bad guys as well. Maybe. Like, you have a versus mode like Left 4 Dead did and stuff. Maybe. That could be kind of cool. <clears throat> and also, uh, Doom and Gears, yeah. I think, right? Was it Gears? No, it wasn't Gears. No, uh, Doom, definitely. It's just Doom, I think. I felt like there was something else that was doing it, too. But, but yeah, Doom is doing that same idea of, like, a versus where you're the demons and the Doom guys. So. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, that's it for you plays, uh, or you. That's it for Ubisoft yep. and the press conference here. And you play. Um, just stay tuned for all the new stuff coming for E3, and we'll be putting it up here as soon as we can. Subscribe.